What's going on, guys? We are back with another Skylanders review. And who is it? Gil Grunt. Look at him. He's a pretty cool looking dude. I like the design. It's really cool. He is a water Skylanders, you can see. Level 10. And, uh, yeah. So, let's, uh, let's get him in a good level. We'll do one that'll work on his terms. Oil Spill Island. Changing it up. Ooh. Alright. Gil Grunt. Level 10. 19 heroics, because I, I don't have his three elemental power ones that I just forgot, but still though, he's a beast. Once you give him the power ups, he takes a while to get used to believe me. He's boring at first. Harpoon um excuse me. Harpoon gun. Shoot high velocity harpoons at your enemies. Power hose. Press and hold B on the Wii Remote to spray water at your enemies to knock them back. Barbed harpoons. Harpoons do increased damage. See how the design's different too. High pressure ho power hose. Power hose attack does extra damage and knocks enemies back further. That really doesn't do much, but when you get a soul gem ability, you'll see how amazing it is. Harpoon repeater. Harpoons reload faster. Water jetpack. Probably one of the best abilities he has. Press Z on the Wii Remote to fly until the water jetpack runs out. Increase speed and armor while flying. How cool is that? He's so freaking fast because of it. Now for his path, I chose the water path instead of the harpoon path. I read a lot of debates on it, and water path seems to be the good way to go, and I'll show you why. Reserve water tank. The power hose and water jet never, you that, never run out of water. That's why I chose it. Infinite water. Boiling water hose. Power hose attack does even more damage. Neptune Gun this is a fun one. When using the power hose, press A to launch exploding creatures. It's really worth it. These starfish just come out of nowhere and just start killing everything. Anchor Cannon. Hold A to charge the Anchor Cannon. Requires Soul Gem and Treetop Terrace. That's a really cool attack. So, yeah. First off, he's a water guy, so he can swim, obviously. Now. Watch this. Jetpack, baby. Look at that. How freaking cool and unique is that? I think that's awesome. Harpoons. Pretty good distance. See, he's slow, but because I have the uh, thing, he's good. Done, baby. Look at that. Alright, let's get rid of the spell pump because he's a real pain in the ass. So what we're going to do is we're going to spray these guys with water. Now watch, when I hit A, you see that? Little starfish are coming out of nowhere and bombing the hell out of them. I think that's really freaking cool. And they're strong as hell. His water hose is useless until you get that if you ask me. That's just my two cents though. Oops. I've been here in a while. My apologies. Next. Watch this. Boom! Holding A gets you this. Oh shit! Boosh! I, I know, but I'm not going to do that. The puzzles are fairly easy. I think we want it. Yeah, that's fine. Should be this one. Yep. Cool beans. And then we're going to use the key. Free him. That's your objective for the whole level. But if you want to unlock more stuff, don't bother with it. Watch this. Laser literally will just kill them. But only when you rotate it, but it's pretty cool stuff. 
be this little guy. What attacks are there? You wanna go? Yeah, you can attack while you're in jetpack mode too, which is awesome. Watch this. The only problem with the jetpack is that once you're clicking it, you can, you can't move any other direction. You just go a certain way. It kind of defies the laws of anything, but it's Skylanders, you know. Right, watch this. Suck it. To the little starfish again, just so you can see how amazing and powerful that is. Yeah, he's a, he's a pretty cool looking dude. Oops, I don't know I'm doing. I'm just trying to show you this stuff, I don't care about the level. Uh, we'll go this way. That jetpack is really helpful for like time trials and stuff. If you're in trouble with that, do that. It's great. I just find the harpoon gun pretty lame. Plus, I get this. I mean, come on. I need for a harpoon gun when I've got a huge friggin' anchor sticking out of my gun. Look at that. Notice how there's like steam coming out of the water? That's how freaking fast it's coming out. And then also, if you look closely, red stuff comes out. No, I'm just kidding, that's because of me. So there we have it. His abilities. He's strong once you give him upgrades. He's weak as hell at first. As most of them are. Like, I got killed a lot in story mode with him. But get his upgrades and you'll be solid. So, next up is challenge. See you guys.